incidence of foodborne disease is increasing worldwide. 2,200,000 people die every year from diarrhea caused by contaminated food or water. Out of every five victims, approximately four are children. The risks associated with handling and preparing food are all too often ignored. Food can be contaminated at any time during production, processing, transportation, storage and preparation. Teaching people the basics of safe food handling is therefore essential to prevent foodborne diseases. WHO, the World Health Organization, has developed a global message, five keys to safer food. Keep clean, separate raw and cooked, cook thoroughly, keep food at safe temperatures, use safe water and raw materials. WHO recently developed five new keys to growing safer fruit and vegetables. Practice good personal hygiene. Protect fields from animal faecal contamination. Use treated faecal waste. Evaluate and manage risks from irrigation water. Keep tools and storage areas clean and dry. Adopting these simple rules will have an impact on hygiene-directed behaviour in general. WHO is proactively working to promote this message, for example in Senegal. With the support of Professor Kolsek, the Minister of Health of Senegal, WHO representatives organised in 2012 an initial training workshop to launch a national awareness raising plan. The five keys to safer food were used as an introduction to this training workshop that brought together 40 women community leaders. Ces cinq clés peuvent s'utiliser non seulement en temps de paix, en temps normal pour sécuriser les populations, mais en temps de catastrophe, voire d'épidémie. On peut utiliser ces cinq clés pour éviter la propagation de ces maladies-là. The training included practical exercises, such as a visit to the Fan Hospital Vegetable Garden, which was designed to provide nutrient-rich food for patients with AIDS. The women know what they need to do to diversify their diet and eat more fruit and vegetables. Thanks to the training, they know all the keys to help them grow fruit and vegetables without risk. Le ministère accueille à bras ouverts cette formation. Déjà, ces femmes constituent la cible de ce ministère. On a d'abord donc des causes. On va répéter que les femmes jouent un rôle essentiel. Il faut aussi la promotion du lavage des mains pendant les moments critiques. The discussions bore fruit. The participants established a national alliance to promote food safety and took the first steps towards developing a national action plan. La contamination des aliments ne dépend pas seulement de la préparation, mais c'est une chaîne qu'on doit suivre de la plantation à l'assiette. La formation nous a permis aussi de prendre conscience de certaines pratiques courantes dans nos communautés et des pratiques qui étaient néfastes. The training included communication techniques to spread the message as widely as possible in communities throughout Senegal. Nos perspectives sont énormes. Nos perspectives sont sans limite. Parce que là, on vient de nous prendre les cinq clés. La première chose qu'on va faire, c'est aller vers ces gens, les sensibiliser. We are very happy to support um, the program because food safety is an important issue in the United States, as well as in Senegal and in the other countries of the world. Women everywhere have a vital role to play in improving community health and ensuring that future generations adopt safe practices to avoid foodborne diseases. WHO therefore encourages all countries to train women and enable them to make an even bigger contribution to sustainable development.